Hi guys, welcome to another new episode. This LED bulb is good and it produces light. But this LED bulb is damaged so it cannot give light. Today I will show you how to fix a bad LED bulb. If you move the diffuser optics or lamp cover of the LED bulb to the right and left, you will find a lock. Now it will be easy to separate the cover of the LED bulb. I removed the cover. Now I will check all the LED chips on the PCB board. I will use my pre-made module to check the LED chips. With this, the voltage of all types of LEDs can be checked and whether they are good or not. I have given the link required to make this module in the description. All the LED chips located in the top row are good. This LED chip in the second row is damaged. I am now checking the other LED chips. The second row of broken chips will be replaced, so I am checking the voltage of the chips on this PCB. The chips are showing 5.35 volts. So these are basically 5 to 6 volt LEDs. I marked the positive and negative terminals of the chips stuck in the second row on the PCB. I am checking 5 to 6 volt LEDs from an old PCB board. I marked the positive and negative terminals of the chips stuck in the PCB. Since I did not open the two cables completely, I cannot understand which is the positive and negative terminal. So I marked one of the cables. Now I separated the positive and negative terminal connection cables from the PCB board with a soldering iron. I will use a LED resoldering module that I made myself to remove the LED chips from the PCB board. I have given the video link of making this module in the description. I turned on the module. It heats up very quickly, so the LED chip can be easily removed or installed from the PCB. It should be remembered that it cannot be overheated. If it gets too hot, the LED chip on the PCB will be damaged. I removed an LED chip from this PCB board and installed the LED chip on the main PCB, keeping the negative and positive poles in order. After installing, I quickly removed the PCB from the heat plate. I checked again if the LED chip is OK and it is lit. I screwed the PCB onto the heat sink of the bulb. Now I connected each cable to the PCB correctly. Now I am checking if the bulb lights up. Wow! The bulb is lighting up normally and it is emitting light. Now I found the lock to attach the diffuser optics or lamp cover of the bulb. The lock was an extra part that was visible. I placed the notched part of the diffuser optics or lamp cover on the lock and pressed it. The diffuser optics or lamp cover was stuck. The bulb is now usable again. How the video is and how to make it better, you can write your opinion in the comment section. I hope you liked this video. If you like this video, don't forget to press like button and share to your friends. Stay tuned by subscribing to my channel and presses the bell button to get the next video.